Welcome to the first episode of Nick Jukebox for 2016, and today we're going back to basics. We're not going to be playing any songs from a particular show, we're going to be playing a whole bunch of songs from various shows. We haven't done this since August of 2014, that was a year and a half ago. Today, that's going to change, and today I'm including a brand new rule. I'm not going to be including songs from a particular era and breaking it up into pieces. I'm going to be playing whatever song that I want. It could be songs from 90s, it could be songs from the 2000s, it could be songs from only 80s, or just a mishmash of all the above. I'll even include some songs that came out just recently to mix things up a bit. The first episode of Nick Jukebox for 2016 is going to start off with the opening theme to Pinwheel. Pinwheel, considered to be the very first show ever to feature on Nickelodeon back when it was called the Pinwheel Network. For most hardcore Nickelodeon fans, it is considered to be one of the quintessential classic Nickelodeon shows. For kids like myself who grew up in the 90s, they didn't know really too much about it, or even at all, because it wasn't part of our generation. And when looking back on it, it just seems like nothing more than just a simple Sesame Street clone. But for a lot of people who grew up in the 70s and the 80s, this was their staple of entertainment. And then afterwards, we're going to jump straight over to the 2000s with You Bounce from As Told By Ginger, which was actually featured in the last episode of the series, The Wedding Frame. And then afterwards, we got plenty of other songs from plenty of other shows, so here we are with the theme song to Pinwheel. <laughs>
Jimmy Who. I flip a switch, she's in the atmosphere In my drop top, rockin' doin' my 10 I'm a little shootin' star in the making Drop a new drum bomb, never faking. Cause I'm headed for the top, no mistaken And my destiny's mine for the taking. At the burners on rock, cause it's like to Just in case a black hole wanna act up I'm a big shot, moon king comin' up In control of my life like a spaceship But I still keep it real with my parents Don't let one trip while I'm on earth When I'm in the make a way, it's my way Just trust giving up in an option Where I'm going ain't no man ever been of the Kilted Yaxman. Our country reeks of trees. Our yaks are really large and they smell like rotting beef carcasses. And we have to clean up after them and our saddle sores are the best. We proudly wear women's clothing and searing sandlows up our skirts. And the buzzards, they soar overhead. And poisonous snakes will devour us whole. And our bones will bleach in the sun. That's it! And we will probably go.
And that was the Royal Canadian Kilted Yaxman theme song from The Ren and Stimpy Show. If Happy Happy Joy Joy or the theme song from The Ren and Stimpy Show wasn't iconic, then this one definitely is, especially with the whole censoring of the word hell and including it with a fart noise. But regardless, the Royal Canadian Kilted Yaxman is considered to be one of the most memorable episodes of The Ren and Stimpy Show. And not to mention one of the most memorable songs that ever played. And then before that, it was Go Jimmy Jimmy by Aaron Carter from the Jimmy Neutron Boy Genius soundtrack. It was actually played in a handful of episodes of the TV series, but it was the movie that it first debuted in. And then before that, it was What I Want to Do by No Authority, which featured on All That Season 5. And then before that, it was You Bounce from As Told by Ginger, and before that, it was a theme song from Pinwheel. Coming up, we're about to continue our row of songs with Man from President of the United States of America, um, which was a song that featured on the Good Burger soundtrack. With the recent passing of Abe Bogota, I think it would be a nice tribute to play one of the songs that actually featured in the movie. And then afterwards, we have Ain't No More from Catdog, which featured in the TV movie The Great Parent Mystery. Yeah, The Great Parent Mystery is, uh, it's all right. I mean, the majority of the movie, it's about Catdog trying to search for their parents and finding out where they came from. Unfortunately, it just becomes a little bit of a downer because it's revealed that, spoilers, they were actually found by a Sasquatch and a frog and they were raised in a cave and we actually never really did find out about where they came from. We don't know if they were aliens, we don't know if they were a a part of a scientific experiment or they were just born that way and they were left abandoned. The movie should have been all about Lou because we actually know more about his background than Catdog, which is kind of a shame because the whole movie is about Catdog. Yeah, I mean, you're know about me, Catdog has never been one of my favorite Nickelodeon shows, and The Great Parent Mystery, with it being one of the last episodes of the series, it kind of just leaves on a whimper instead of a high note. And then afterwards, we have more songs, so here we are with Man from President of the United States of America. Hassled by the man The man The man The man
cussing, fight, but ain't no more. Ain't no more. We used to scratch and bite, but ain't no more. Ain't no more. We love to chase you all about and lift your song, your eyeballs out. We used to cuss and fight, but ain't no more. Ain't no more. We used to hate that guts, but ain't no more. Ain't no more. We used to whoop dog butts, but ain't no more. We love to make you whine and cry. We long to see you up and die. We used to cuss and fight, but ain't no more. Is it time yet, Jody? Uh, a, a little later, Sam. Oh. I love the rain. I love it when it's raining. You'll find me smiling while others are complaining. I love the rain. Love it when it's raining outdoors I love the rain, the puddles and the splashes Feel it on my face, it makes me blink my eyelashes I love the rain, I love it when it's raining outdoors I love the it's rain, Showers. I could soak it up just like the flowers for hours. I love the rain. I love it when it's raining outdoors. I love it when it's raining outdoors. I love it when it's raining outdoors. Yesterday, through poppies wild, we rode for miles, galloping into an endless maze. So blue as the sky, we dreamed upon. How could today turn out so wrong and leave me lost and longing for yesterday? But we got tomorrow. Who needs yesterday? So tomorrow's always just a day away Where this road will lead to No one can say We'll count the miles, we'll the miles. It, takes a while. it takes a while And we'll share the smiles along the way Cause we got tomorrow we got Who needs yesterday
for yourself The best part is the middle of me I'm sponge, baby, gonna squeeze I'm like cute aggression What you believe me? Squeeze me Squeeze me till I pop Squeeze me till you drop Squeeze Me by Nerd, which featured in the second SpongeBob SquarePants movie, Sponge Out of the Water. I haven't seen this movie yet, and I plan on doing so in the future because, if you recall from the Nickelodeon Slimecast podcast YouTube channel, we're going to be doing the Summer of Nickelodeon Movies! So I will be taking a look into it, but I have been listening to the soundtrack, and the soundtrack is pretty good, although not as good as the first one. But this song was a bit of a standout for me. And then before that, it was Only Tomorrow from Hey Arnold, which featured in the episode Road Trip, in which Helga and Miriam go on a road trip. It's a really great episode that showcases on who Miriam is as a character, and it actually fleshes out more of Helga's character, who is hands down the most developed character in the show. So, if you haven't seen the episode in a while, I highly recommend that you check it out. And before that, it was I Love the Rain from Today's Special. Again, another good song from this 1980s classic, and I really don't have too much to say about it. The songs from Today's Special have always been really decent, especially Jeff's dancing, since he was a great choreographer. Then, I recommend that you check out a handful of episodes. And before that, it was Ain't No More from Cat Dog, which featured in The Great Parent Mystery. And before that, it was Man from Presidents of the United States of America from the Good Burger soundtrack. Now we're about to conclude this episode with more songs. The first one being Long Trail by Tara Key, which featured on The Adventures of Pete and Pete. And then afterwards, which we have Oh My My from the Chalk Zone soundtrack. And then afterwards, we got more songs right before we conclude it. So here we are with Long Trail by Tara Key, which featured on The Adventures of Pete and Pete.
dog, you're a dog. Everybody do the dog. Bet you're gonna do the dog all day long. Doberman, Pinsir, Beagle, Pekingese, Cookie, Collie, Bulldog, Great Pyrenees. Chase a car, there you are, sleep it round the clock. Waiting for the cable man to chase around the block. <laughs> Minotaur snouts on deep dog spits. Lost hops of poodle, Chihuahua mouse spit. Labrador retriever, whippet harrier. Shih Tzu, Chow Chow, Fox Terrier. <laughs> Everybody's searching for something to believe in. Well, I believe in you. Don't have to be no Superman as long as you. Think you can? There's nothing that you cannot do. So when you're afraid, don't be discouraged. Find courage in me. You'll never be alone. Now while I'm around, you always have a friend. You up again. Nobody ever can hurt you, and nothing in the world can keep you down. Now I'll I'm, now I'll I'm around. We've been reaching to the stars. Stop. 
unpleasant reverie Perhaps you haven't got the time To be fanciful of And that was The Chance Parade by Harvey Beeks. Yes, this is our first new show that we've put into Nick Jukebox. And yes, this is definitely one of the best songs that I have ever heard. Considering that the person who wrote and composed this song, he said he was heavily influenced by the Beatles when doing this number. And he said it was one of his favorite songs that he had ever done in his career. Not to mention that the animation is gorgeous. It looks like it was taking a lot of inspiration from anime. More specifically, um, My Neighbor Totoro with all the crazy looking creatures in this simple forest setting. It's an amazing episode and I highly recommend that you check it out if you happened. And then before that, it was Not While I'm Around by Maritza Hogg from the Taina soundtrack. And then before that, it was Doggy Rap from Doug. And then before that, it was Oh My My from Chalk Zone. And before that, it was Long Trail by Tara Key, which featured on the adventures of Pete and Pete. Now we're about to conclude this episode with the ending theme to Kablam! And that concludes the first episode of Nick Jukebox for 2016. I'm Patricia, and I hope to catch you around Old School Lane soon. Thanks for listening.